If there was real reincarnation, you died and you got to come back again. Your personality, you knew everything you did in the past life. You would know that, oh yeah, it's really in my interest to create a better future, right? I'll save all my money, bury it in the backyard, and then I can dig it up in my future life. That would be your psychology, because you knew it was going to be you, right? So all I'm saying is, is as a practical fact, you're going to exist again, asshole. Yeah, it's just that you're not going to have your memory. You're not going to know where you buried the gold. But everything else is going to be pretty much the goddamn same, okay? It's going to be another consciousness, another equal consciousness. All the snowflakes, they might all be unique, but guess what? They're all fucking snowflakes. And if you're going to do something for one snowflake, you, why wouldn't you do it for the other snowflake and that snowflake? And if you weren't a selfish little petty fucking snowflake, if you were something like the snowflake manager, you wouldn't do this. It's only happening to me, so that's the way it only matters. It only matters when it's happening to Snowflake 53. He's the only snowflake that matters. All the rest of the snowflakes can go fuck themselves. No, that's not what the manager of the snowflakes would be doing. He wouldn't see a distinction between Snowflake 53 and Snowflake 6,797,432. He wouldn't see a fucking difference between those two fucking snowflakes. If suffering has to happen, he'd have a dilemma. Well, who do I, who suffers? You're not going to have a problem being a selfish prick. But you're not doing the philosophy thing. The philosophy thing means I'm no longer a snowflake. I'm over here looking at snowflakes. That's what philosophy is. It doesn't begin and end with me. Making me comfortable or making me happy. That's one snowflake. It doesn't mean anything. As somebody who's going to understand that all of these things matter, every single bit of it matters, I can't use my intelligence, my judgment, and just simply say, well, how does it affect me? That's called being an ignorant asshole, a preposterously ignorant asshole, considering the 10,000 years of civilization you have behind you. You're way too fucking informed to be that fucking stupid.